Greg Doucette from the Rook and Raven Pub in beautiful downtown Saskatoon. And today we are making turkey sliders with what's that special ingredient? Mustard. Turkey sliders. So, fresh ground turkey, rolled oats, prepared yellow mustard. Really gives these turkey sliders that certain je ne sais quoi. Grated onion, fresh cilantro, a salt-free herb and garlic mix, and some smoked paprika. And then just a wee little bit of kosher salt and freshly ground black pepper. Okay, so we're gonna get in here and mix these all up. Don't be afraid to use your hands, okay? Look at how vibrant that is with that beautiful mustard in there. Mmm, it smells amazing too. So once it's all mixed up, kind of into a little ball like this, then we can make them into our little slider patties. So one of these lovely little dishes that I was using to put all the seasonings into. We're just gonna fill that up to the, to the small little rim about three quarters of the way there. Bring it out. Just work it with your hands. They don't have to be like super awesomely shaped or even a perfect round or even all the same shape. You're not saving lives, you're just making sliders, okay? Okay, so you've got your slider patties made up. Get your pan hot with a little bit of canola oil. You wanna hear that sizzle? Okay, you wanna get these nice and brown on the outside? Okay, so we're just gonna check Oh, beautiful. Nice and brown. Okay, give it a flip. Don't hesitate. Just go, okay? And then we've got these beautiful little balls of bocconcini here, also known as fresh mozzarella, okay? So, we're just gonna finish these. Just give it a couple of tears. Now these are the mini ones. You can buy regular size ones as well too, okay? Two little mini balls there. So now that we've got the bocconcini cheese on there, we're just gonna toss her in the oven and get that cheese all melty and happy. Oh, we got some ooey, gooey, melty deliciousness. So these guys are done. We're gonna set up our buns now. A little bit of mustard. And basically the possibilities are endless, okay? We have a little bit of arugula. Arugula and mustard go really well together too. They're, they've got a nice little, arugula's kind of peppery and mustard's got that nice tangy bite to it. Some little tiny grape tomatoes for some little tiny turkey sliders. And let's get those right on top. I like to use a little bit of pickled red onion that we pickle at the rook, using a little bit of mustard seed, of course. There you have it, turkey sliders. Using mustard not only as a condiment, but as a key ingredient. Goes great with this Mardi Gras picnic salad. Both are found in the Mustard Makeovers and More recipe book. Thanks again for joining us.